Hey everyone, welcome back to Playing Quietly. My name is Ryan, and today I'm bringing you another Remnant 2 guide. Today we're going to be talking about one of the community favorite mutations for weapons, Twisting Wounds. So to start things off, we're going to be re-rolling our adventure mode for Losum, and we're going to be looking to start in Marrow Parish. Now, once there, we're going to be running through that starting area, and we're going to be looking for an area that is on fire because we're going for either Cotton's Kiln or the Butcher's Quarters. Now, the reason I say that we want to start in Marrow Parish is, like I said, it's going to be very obvious when we run across that burning area. Now, the tile set we're actually looking for only has a chance to spawn in those two dungeons. However, the tile set itself is quite obvious. It's denoted by a very large crater usually at the very beginning of the instance, and we can see it here in the video. So I'm just going to let the video play through for a moment, and I'll show you the path that we need to take to find the entrance. All right, so now that we are down in the sewer area, what we are going to do is we're going to throw this switch on this hallway down here, and that is going to spawn uh, the aberration that we are looking for. And then once we kill him, we get the mutator. All right, so let's take a look at the mutator itself. Increases range damage of this weapon by 20% to bleeding targets. And at level 10, this weapon's ranged weak spot and ranged critical hits apply bleeding, dealing 750 bleed damage over 10 seconds. So we see here that this is going to be applying a bleed that's going to then buff our range damage by 20% plus whatever other bleed modifiers we have equipped. So this is just a really, really powerful mutator all around. All right, guys, that's all I got for you today. Thank you so much for joining us. If you found this video helpful or entertaining, hopefully I have earned your subscription. But until then, we will see you guys next time. Have yourselves a good one.